Hello guys, welcome to my channel and in this video we will make this. First open After Effect, then select New Projects, then click the Composition button and name it as Main Comp and leave the rest of the setting same then import your media file and drag it down to your timeline then right click your media layer and select track and stabilize and select camera tracking after tracking we will see the track points like this then select one of the track point and click right click on it and then select create solid end camera then again create new composition and name it as black screen and leave rest of the settings same then press this button so your background will be erased then import black screen image this image dimension as same as my phone screen then drag it down to black screen composition then select shape tool if you can't see your toolbar then press ctrl plus 1 then select round edges square tool and make small square and then rearrange it according to your black screen image. Then select shape layer and make duplicate of it by pressing ctrl plus D. Then select first shape layer and press T for opacity and make the opacity 10%. Select second shape layer, make fill to nil and stroke 10 pixels. Then select both the shape layer and pre-compose it and name it glass screen. Copy the phone screen media by pressing Ctrl plus C and paste it on main comp by pressing Ctrl plus V. Then select the phone screen media and link it to the track solid one and press 3D button. Then hide the track solid one by pressing I button. Then change the scale and position of your phone screen media according to your phone. Then create duplicate of phone screen media. Then select first phone screen media and press mode button. Then change track matte to alpha inverted matte phone screen PNG. Then go to black screen composition and copy glass screen and paste it on main comp composition. Link the glass screen to phone screen media and press 3D button then change scale and position of glass screen layer then we go to glass screen and change something we delete shape layer 1 and change the color of shape layer 2 we change the stroke color white to neon blue then we go to glass screen and copy the shape layer and paste it on black screen and change the color of shape layer to white. Then we again copy shape layer 2 from black screen and paste it on main comb. Press the 3D button and link to phone screen. Then we change scale and position of shape layer 2 for making depth in phone. Then we drag the shape layer to below the main media layer. Then create duplicate of shape layer and scale it smaller and change its position down from previous shape layer. Go to your glass screen composition then import your chip PNG media and drag it to your timeline. Create solid layers so you can see both the layer easily. 
then scale it. Then we create shape. In this, fill is nil and stroke 15 pixels and scale it according to your chip layer. Then select all the shape layer and pre-compose it and name it component. Then we create one more shape and import our PNG circle file and drag it to your timeline and scale it. Create duplicate of circle layer and position it. And select the PNG circle layer, then put your cursor at the end of the timeline. Press the toggle button of rotation and rotate it. Then go to main comb and create a square shape between the circle shape. Press 3D button and link it to phone screen. Then scale and position it. Then we create shape. Press 3D button and link the shape layer to phone screen layer. Then scale and position it. Select the shape layer and press the toggle button of position. Then move your cursor one second and change the position and do this to the end of the timeline. Then create one more circle shape in this fill nil and stroke 15 pixel. Then press 3D button and link it to phone screen media. Then create duplicate of shape layer 8 and change it position and scale. Then change the color of one of the shape layer. Put your cursor to starting. Select the shape layer 10 and change the Y rotation to minus 30. Then select the shape layer 9 and change the Y rotation to plus 30. Then press toggle button of Y rotation of both the shape layer. Then go to one second further and select the shape layer 10 and change the Y rotation to plus 30 and select the shape layer 9 and change the Y rotation to minus 30. Then keep the changing of Y rotation of both the shape layer to the end of the timeline.
then import your logo png media and drag it to your main com timeline then press 3d button and link it to phone screen media then change its scale and position then create duplicates of logo layer and move it side by side then go to glass screen composition and import your screen recording media and drag it down to your timeline then press the mode button and change the mode to screen then select the screen recording and pre compose it then go to screen recording composition and scale it then copy the screen recording composition and paste it to main com and change its blend mode to screen then import your another screen recording media and drag it to your glass screen composition timeline then select the screen recording media and pre compose it then go to screen recording composition and scale it then change the blend mode of screen recording composition to screen then go to effect and preset and type glow and drag it to your screen recording composition then change the glow threshold to 100% and glow radius around 500 and glow intensity to around 5 and do the same to another screen recording composition then after this we export it go to file go to export and add to adobe media encoder then press the play button thanks for watching please like this video and subscribe my youtube channel